so the requirement over here is to change the one of the controls background as different color so you can see over here there is data birth here which is having the background color as yellow over here okay it can be red it can be yellow whatever it is so how do we do that okay this is for a specific one so we can do this in two ways one is by adding a text file CSS in a text file and add that into our our skin rule or uh, you can do it through the uh, general format which is there in your skin rule so we'll do the two things first I'll tell you how to do with the CSS file which we create it as a text file to create a text file we have to go to the records explorer expand technical you can see here text file so click on text file over here so I created already BG color text file so if you click on create it will show you uh, the label uh, app which in which directory you want to create in the extension so extension is CSS okay so I created that so you can see here file extension is CSS your file name BG color and uh, a directory I took it as webwb so if I open that in this we need to write what type of color you want okay so to write that we have this right red uh, uh, dot red iPhone BG iPhone input where I'm giving input here and the background I'm taking it as red okay so and save this so now this CSS file you have to include it in this skin rule of your application so how do you see your skin rule go to application menu click on this click on skin rule so in the skin rule you have component styles mix in base settings included styles under included styles you see the additional style sheets and you can check your BG color CSS file is available over here so click on select that BG color and save it okay so this is how you create it now we have to configure it so where do you want to configure so I configured it in date of birth go to this particular section okay so this is the date of birth so in this date of birth what I have to do is I have to go I have to open the cell properties of this date of birth and click on the presentations under presentations add advanced presentation options expand it under this you have to write your CSS um, file whatever you have written red iPhone BG iPhone input so this is what where you have written in your text file right in your BG color okay so red iPhone BG iPhone input so you can write over here and you got this output so you have to write for read only and as well as write only if you want to show that you can write both of them submit save so now you can see it changed it to red okay previously it was yellow because I have changed that yellow uh, red to yellow that's why it is showing in uh, yellow so now let me create a case now it looks red so select this so select your date so this is not actually I mean uh, looking good right so what we do we'll change that into yellow so simply change this red to yellow you can write the code of this particular yellow uh, code also that can also be done now I have written yellow so let's click on order food and you can see it is yellow now so click select any of the uh, thing here so this is how you change um, the uh, what is that um, background uh, col con background uh, color for your uh, control so this is one way by creating CSS but if you look your CSS file um, yeah this is what you did right <coughs> now we will do the in other way so what is other ways I'll go to the skin rule second way this is second way so in this in the uh, skin rule go to component styles so which which uh, background color you want to change so select that so for example you want to change the color of uh, drop down or color of uh, uh, labels and required fields let's check this or text inputs okay text inputs and there is inherited select standard here you have field background so expand this field background you can add now specific style okay 
so let me click on override first yeah overriding now let's change the color so which color example I'll change this okay see can you see now all the things are now changing to uh, uh, this color right right if you see all are changed now okay so how this is getting changed means you have changed the um, your uh, skin rule the standard inherited whichever it is the, uh, whichever already inherited that you change so that's the reason why it is showing to each and everyone and why everything is changed now you have to go to your section and if you look your uh, look your section here look your section uh, open this first name and go to presentation if you look here the control format is standard here so as the control format is standard already you have changed the control format of that standard overridden with the field background as a solid oh, sorry this particular color so that's the reason why it is changing okay and over here itself you can see uh, what what if it is over okay so expand this um, so what is hovering you have to check here so whenever it is hovering okay background is what background so background it is showing ash color right so you can change this to uh, some green uh, green color save it save so whenever I hover it it will change to green okay see okay so let me create a case okay now whenever it is hovering it is changing to some other one so this is how you do the uh, color background of particular image so which is better I think uh, we, I uh, recommend you to go with the skin rule instead of going with the uh, going with the text file okay uh, but you might be getting question for only I want only for the first name then why I don't want to go for last name and I don't want to see all these things then for that what you have to do is instead of inheriting it you have to create your own style okay so click on own style uh, bg color for um, so i'll give it text bg color text background i'll go with text background okay so now in this text background in this text background now you can see same the you can change these changes okay and uh, here also hover you can change save it and use this text bg format in one of, in one of your control under your section rule okay so I'll do it for the first name okay this is my this is the first name so go to presentation instead of standard I'll go with BG, text BG can you see text BG is showing now submit save see already there is a change out of it so can you see now for others it is different but for this it is again a different one so hope now you understood how to change the uh, background color of a specific control thank you